is we're going to go ahead and install this byte. So let's click on next and I'll just add in my email address and I'll click on finish. And it's just going to go ahead and do its installation. So we'll just give that a moment. And finally, we'll come to the end and we should have a good looking Drupal CMS site. And there we go. Look at that. Now, straight away, you might be thinking, wait a minute, where's Olivero? Well, no, now we have a new theme called Mercury. Now this theme does look pretty good, I must admit. It looks, it looks nice. So that's the new theme. So let me open this up in incognito so we can see it in its full glory. So you got this nice little header, got these um, three items in a grid, icons, explore. It's pretty much just a good looking agency type of website. Now, I understand this isn't groundbreaking, but when it comes to Drupal sites, you know, a lot of people complain about, oh, you know, Drupal sites don't look good. Well, that really comes down to the design, really. You know, I'm not, I'm not fussed about the design. I just want good, I don't know, configuration management or something, I don't know. So then up the top here, we have a few pages. We have feature, we have all these components. We've got this like teaser component. Then we have, no, where is it? Pricing, nice pricing table, which is pretty cool resources, blog, and contact. And this is all controlled by Drupal Canvas, by the way. 